This concert on the 9th of July, I'm going to be singing mainly the solo in the 4A Requiem. That's in the second half of the concert. And in the first half of the concert, I believe I'm singing some Mozart and some Schumann. So it's not often that I get to learn absolutely new repertoire, especially by composers such as Schumann, who one assumes that they know most of his works, but I've never heard of the Offertorium from the Requiem before now, and so I'm very much looking forward to learning that and performing it with Laura, the cellist, and Yestin on the organ. Cardinal Basil Hume was a familiar name to me as a Catholic growing up in London. My father was the assistant organist at the cathedral, as Basil Hume was was cardinal there. And I believe he was extremely important in in the Catholic tradition, but also in the sort of social life of Westminster at the time and ever since. And he's obviously left a legacy of kindness and charity in the area and in London. Homelessness has always been a problem and I think, I believe, it's even worse now, now that we have the social economic crises in London and, and in our country. So I think it's incredibly important that we keep his name alive but also his work alive. And concerts like this hopefully will raise awareness of that but also raise money for this particular homeless charity. St James's Spanish Place is such a beautiful church and it's really lovely space it's huge it's kind of beautiful inside but it's um lovely acoustic there and so sort of perfect for the foyer requiem i would say and i think it'll really lend itself to the music that we're performing on the 9th of july so i think this concert is going to appeal to first of all f- fans of the classical well-known repertoire such as the Foyer Requiem and the Mozart, but there's also some things on here that I don't know and haven't heard of. Franz Schmidt, for instance, there's an organ prelude. There's some chant being sung by the the scholar, the choir of the Cardinal Vaughan School. And apparently Basil Hume was a, a lover of Gregorian chant, so I think it's always lovely just to sit and let that sound wash over you uh, in a sort of meditative way. Performing music in the context of raising money for a charity, it gives it sort of depth and meaning beyond just the the joy of performing and singing. And especially when a lot of people pull together on one day to raise money for something that is outside of their own gain, it's it's very satisfying and and can be a very joyful thing, I think. Please do come and support this concert and hear what we have to offer.